Okay, uh, let's get started. Uh, I will need heavy support from the my microphone. This will be short, and it even might end up earlier than I envisaged. <clears throat> there will be a couple of announcements, so please stay in the room. I know there is a workshop starting soon. We try to make it quick. This was the ATLX, right? Um, Normally, this is the moment where um, I should say it's been all great and everything just, you know, was superb and I am everything, you know, happy, happy about everything. But honestly, um, I would feel stupid saying this at this place after what happened on Tuesday to Thierry. Great is not a word that I can use, but it was intense by all means. Um, it was state of the art and I just cannot cannot stress this enough, uh, how uh, I am very much fond, and uh, this I, I really do. I think I can say that I'm really fond of the um, quality of the of all the talks that we had. Uh, we also thought provoking, uh, as we saw also today. Um, it was fast as usual, program packed two and a half days. And it was community building um, a lot, I think. So, you know, as for communities, the wrong order, doesn't matter. We've got AsiaLex, Elex, URLX, DSNA, Afrilex, all quite small communities um, around the uh, world selexes, uh, overlapping with big events like LREC, you know, ACL, computational linguistics, corpus linguistics, whatever. Uh, Globalex, sorry, I'm Elon, I put you at the end, but um, you know. Uh, what I want to say, we are a really small community. I think so. We, we, we need to be aware of that. Um, maybe because of that, we are also that much affected if we lose someone like Adam Kilgariff, uh, like Taneke Schoenheim, uh, like Thierry de Clark this week. And perhaps even more important is then for us to meet. There were 160 people, uh, 17 virtual out of that from 33 countries. This is the distribution. Unsurprisingly, you know, we added up. Four keynotes, almost 60 regular presentations, 17 poster presentations, three demos, one round table, uh, 38 full papers comprising almost 700 pages total. Now, that's the point where I started well, say a lot of thanks to, first of all, Hornby Trust as our single and key sponsor this year. Um, all the, uh, you know, organizing uh, corporations or organizing uh, organizations, it's very weird to say it, say it this way, uh, which means, you know, Simon Craig, Istoko, Samile, Nakalas, uh, Karoti, Berius, and me representing those five institutions. And then, of course, all my colleagues, I mean, uh, we were organizing DLX in 2015, and it's been um, mainly, you know, as for the local organization, Turka and me organizing it from Brno to Hersmond Zoo, uh, a couple of months after Adam died. Um, it's been such a relief to have such a great team of people around me this time. You know, I just cannot stress this enough. I would also like to thank Sabine, Jan, and Michal for acting fast and calm. One of the things that, um, I'm very proud of is we did everything we could for Thierry. Thank you, Tri. I don't know where you are at this moment, but thank you very much. Thanks, Michal and Andre, for the extensive preparation here in the hotel, and otherwise, thanks to our cameraman. Thanks to Michal Mikura and Marek Medved, who spent an incredible amount of time on editing the book of abstracts and proceedings. And last but not least, and in the first place, thank you all for coming. The we only the only good reason why we, why we are making the conference is that you are here, that you think that it's worth it. Otherwise, we could be just sitting home, submit papers to um, you know journals, and that would be it. But you are here, and that's a motivation to continue. Thank you.
yes, um, I'm so I'm changing my hats now. Uh, Milos was mentioning the um, different lexes, uh, and several of us are now also on the Eurolex board. And I would like to take this opportunity for the announcement. Is the very first place we are announcing this. I must prepare the things that will go to the mailing list. But this is the announcement. Uh, many of you here um, are maybe are not aware, but it's this year is marks the 40th anniversary of Eurolex. So the first conference took place 40 years ago, and we decided to to basically utilize this gap here because the ULX conference is next year with a lecture series. Um, and uh, so it's between October 4 to 13th every day, um, not on a week, uh, just on weekdays, not on weekends. Uh, there will be seven talks and two interviews. Um, and uh, this is the lineup. Uh, I won't so the, the common thing of all these names, they are all presidents of Eurolex, either past or present. Um, we, uh, some of them uh, we got to and um, were, they felt they're not up to the task or that they, they just, um, you know, age, I, that was the reason sometimes mentioned, but they will send also some of the thoughts to the to the presentations, and one of so the presentations will be online. I, they will mix the the presenters were able to choose whether they want to present in the afternoon or in the morning. Um, and the last uh, important thing that it was decided was that this will be a, a two hour slot. Uh, I'm very happy to say that all the presenters agreed to this. So there will be one hour of presentation followed by a sort of one hour let's say an open floor uh, which will be which will target specifically younger lexicographers either future maybe they are still doing MA or PhD but we just thought you know sometimes you have a big room and it it's a bit daunting when you have a senior lexicographer and maybe they are not uh, really uh, um, brave enough to ask questions so we will sort of not we will not record this session it will be done only so really uh, they will be specifically targeted and we're trying to start some trend where you know passing the knowledge and uh, give advice and things like that so that's all I have to say uh, more information is coming in the following days via e email Hi, I'm Regiane Zacarias. Uh, this is my colleague, uh, Adrian Urenha, and we also have Tanara back there. And uh, on behalf of the founding committee, I would like to announce the Association for Lexicography of the Americas, South, Central, Mexico, and the Caribbean, America Lex. America Lex S. And we have our first uh, inaugural conference coming up in October uh, 20th, the pre-workshop, uh, and from the 23rd to the 22nd to the 25th, the conference itself. We would like to welcome you all in Brazil, Sao Paulo, State Un Sao Paulo University, and uh, please check our website for the call for papers and, you know, join us. <laughs> it's, a, it's been quite a work, and uh, we hope to see you know you guys there. Uh, it's not restricted to the region; it's linguistic. So you know any language based uh, from that area is very welcome. Okay, thank you. Yeah, I'm back. Um, <laughs> Yes, uh, well, this will be short. Um, Milos mentioned at the beginning that we know the location of the next ELEX. And so I'm very happy to say that we've, be, we've had some discussion. We decided it, it will be a 10th anniversary when we started the series. So we decided to bring it back to Slovenia. Um, 
Oh, some of my colleagues, they don't know yet. Uh, I'll, I'll ask you in two years whether you're still happy about that, right? <laughs> Um, okay, and uh, I'm not so going to say it's going to be in Ljubljana because that was the last te 10 years ago we said, oh, well, it's going to be in Ljubljana and it ended up being in Bled. Um, it was a good choice, but so the lo exact location still to be decided. Thank you. Uh, I'll just say a few words. So this is also related to the last um, announcement because uh, the same bunch of people is organizing ELEX conference for some time now and we would like to actually give opportunity to others uh, <coughs> to organize the ELEX 27, I guess, yeah. Um, so we, uh, but to do that, we need to do it in a sort of a structured way. And the way we will do it is uh, through the organization that I mentioned uh, several times, uh, it's called now Alexis Association. It might be renamed to Alexis Alliance or Alexis Network, whatever, but institutions can apply. And uh, inside that organization, uh, we will sort out how to uh, actually invite and manage this process of organizing the next after the next elex just join okay um you know i guess this is it really uh once again thanks for coming um thanks everyone for making this oh okay you you can oh sure of course Yes, yeah, sorry. I already announced it this morning. Uh, those who registered for the workshop, we will leave in about 10 minutes after the end of this session. If you, yeah, you can walk on your own to the uh, Faculty of Informatics, but if you are afraid that you will get lost on the way, just we will be outside and we will be guided there with Otto. Yeah, so <laughs> light blue shirt, always safe to follow. So, yeah. <laughs> and thank you, Milos, for the conference. All right. Pleasure meeting you.